Hey, welcome back to another reaction video. If you don't know us, we are a family of six that have moved from the U.S. to New Zealand. I have been here for eight years and sharing the journey. So you can check out my channel and find out all the information you need to know about moving and living in New Zealand. But today we're going to do another reaction video because a couple of reasons. You guys seem to really like them and I enjoy doing them. And you keep sending me all of these things to react to. And I just feel like it would be wrong for me to just watch it and not actually have a reaction to it. And so today we're going to do some commercials again that you guys have sent me that have said, you know, you should check out this and you should. And so now I'm really curious. And so today we're going to watch it. Uh, but the first commercial that I'm going to show you is one that I have seen before, but I just, it's, it's literally probably my favorite commercial. And that says a lot being a marketing person. Uh, and I just need that. I need my U S audience to see this. I need people that who have not seen it. So this is the trumpet commercial. I think it's an Australian ad and it's hilarious. And then we go into a bugger commercial and then we go I don't know what that one's about I th think that may be Australian as well um and then we then there's another one they said I think it's I think these are the Australian ads these are the Australian because the third one is like I don't know take over New Zealand I don't know I haven't seen it so here we go okay this one is so good if you don't think this is funny we can't be friends trumpet simplifying summer how far away from the beach do togs become undies? Skin-tight swimming togs, an item of clothing you'd happily wear in public, but not in public. So how far is too far? Let's begin. Togs, 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 undies, 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 undies. <laughs> if you can't see the water, you're in underpants. Local supermarkets, pedestrian crossings, office buildings, Public transport, anywhere more than 300 meters from the water's edge, all underpants transformation areas. If we treat the budgie <laughs> smuggler with respect, undies, 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 togs, okay. everyone wins. Trumpet, simplifying summer. Okay, is that not one of the funniest ads you've ever seen? <laughs> undies, undies, togs. So if you don't know togs or swimwear, um, if you're not from, you know, Oceana, right? So it's, oh my gosh, it's so, <laughs> this is the, the truck going <laughs> It's like one thing. Okay. That's so good. Like, it's so true. Like, why is it so inappropriate to wear it other places? So anyway, the next one I have not, the next two I have not seen. And I, you guys have sent to me and we're going to do, we're going to do this. This is band, band Toyota. Hmm. Back <laughs> Fuck me. Oh. Fuck it. <laughs> Easy now, son. Oh, yeah, you two words. Ooh, fuck it. You bird. Oh, looks like this is a, there's another one. Okay. Stop soil planks. Top soil planks. Handbrake. Okay. 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 Will always look good in a Hilux. Australia. Okay, sorry, that's moving on to the next one. Let's just comment on that one. I just, okay, so bugger is not a word that I have picked up after being here for eight years. I am not saying that word very much, but it's so funny. And it, what I really like about that commercial actually is it, it highlights the fact that of the laid back attitude of Australia, New Zealand, how like really kind of horrible things happen. The truck goes through, you know, a brick wall, the bad things are happening. You're covered in mud and they just say bugger, like big deal. You know, they're just so laid back. And I love that because they always react. And this is my experience completely. They always react to really like what would make, I would say Americans or a lot of people like really stressed out. They just like, Oh, well, it happens and they let it roll off and they just have a really good um, 
reaction to things. And I really like that because it just reduces all the stress. And it's just like, you know, it's just money. It's just, you know, it happens, things happen and they just accept it and move on. And that's just amazing. So good. A very good quality about this part of the world for sure. Okay. So this one that says Australia declares war on New Zealand, like no idea what that could be. No idea what this is about. Here we go. Yeah, loves a day off. Anzac Day, Labor Day, the Queen's birthday. We love them all. But there aren't many public holidays in the back half of the year. So this Saturday, we're going to war with New Zealand. It'll be up by lunchtime. And to celebrate, the whole country gets Monday off. And then, every year, we can crack a beer to mark the day we smash the Kiwis. Usual. <laughs> Um, I have not seen this. That's hilarious. Okay, that was hilarious. I mean, hilarious. <laughs> I don't know when that came out, but that I have not seen that. As you can see with my reaction, I have not seen that. Okay, 100% easy. We'll be done by noon. You guys, it's so true. It's so true. <laughs> yeah. There's not a lot of protections here. Okay. What was like, it's called Invade New Zealand Department of Defense. Like, what are they advertising? I don't know. That's hysterical. Have you guys seen? I mean, it must be old. I have not seen it. That is so funny. Thank you for sending that one. That's amazing. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's taken me a minute to get over that. It was that second one just kind of threw me. I'm like, okay, this must be the same you know, another ad for the same topic. It just says Australia declares war and it's so funny. Invadenewzealand.com. <laughs> okay, so yeah, let's not tell too many people how easy it is. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video this week. Uh, comment below with other things you'd like me to react to. Thank you so much for sending those. Those have been really great. Um, if you want to shout me a coffee, I'd appreciate it as I'm trying to grow this channel and um, do new things like this. Uh, otherwise, I will see you guys next week.